He convinced Voyager to turn its camera back towards Earth, and it's what basically amounts to Earth's first ever selfie. And that picture was taken, and there was these pale blue dots sitting in this void. In the vast expanse of the cosmos, where mysteries lurk in every corner, a silent guard has been journeying for decades, witnessing the secrets of the universe as they unfold. Voyager 1, our faithful emissary to the stars, has detected not just one, not two, but a staggering 500 unidentified objects traversing the void of space. But these objects are like nothing we've encountered before. They beckon us to question everything we thought we knew about the universe. Are they fragments of ancient cosmic collisions or perhaps indications of civilizations beyond our wildest dreams? Come along as we explore the untold story behind how Voyager 1 has detected 500 unknown objects in the deep reaches of space. Looking Beyond the Stars For nearly five decades, Voyager 1 has been on an extraordinary journey through the vastness of space, uncovering secrets hidden from our view on Earth. This incredible spacecraft, crafted by the brilliant minds at the John Hopkins Jet Propulsion Laboratory, has become our golden messenger, venturing into realms of space that were previously beyond our reach. Away from the limitations of ground-based telescopes, Voyager 1 has been our intrepid explorer, delving into the deep unknowns of intergalactic space. With each passing year, it has encountered phenomena that amaze and mystify us, revealing wonders that challenge our understanding of the cosmos. According to Neil deGrasse Tyson, an astonishing discovery was made as Voyager 1 has detected the presence of 500 unidentified objects gracefully gliding through the silent expanse of space. This revelation not only highlights the ingenuity of human engineering, but also ignites our curiosity about the countless mysteries waiting to be unveiled in the universe. The scientific community was taken aback by this news sending ripples of excitement and curiosity among scientists worldwide. With the revelation of Voyager 1's data, an unusual enigma emerged on the horizon, perplexing even the most seasoned researchers. Ever since Neil deGrasse Tyson confirmed this groundbreaking discovery, scientists have been scrambling to interpret the mysteries hidden within the data. Various theories and interpretations have emerged, each attempting to paint a vivid picture that sheds light on this baffling phenomenon. If it were any other spacecraft transmitting such confusing data, scientists might have questioned its authenticity. However, the undeniable source of these perplexing transmissions from space has sparked intense debate and fascination within the scientific community. But a much deeper investigation has been ongoing in space for a long time. A terrifying voyage through time and space. According to Voyager 1, the spacecraft that's been journeying through the vast expanse of space for nearly 50 years, surpassing all expectations like a resilient patient overcoming cancer. Initially planned for just three years, Voyager 1 has defied the odds, spending over 45 years in space and making groundbreaking discoveries along the way. We could not have claimed to know what was in our own solar system until Voyager conducted its tour, its Homeric odyssey across the outer solar system. People often uh, describe it as one of mankind's greatest journeys. It is certainly the farthest <laughs> and the longest. What makes this story truly captivating is that Voyager is accomplishing all this from an incredibly distant location. The last time scientists checked, it was a staggering 14.5 billion miles away from Earth, hurtling through space at a relentless pace with no signs of slowing down. In fact, researchers calculate that it's moving 3.6 times the distance between Earth and the Sun each year. This astonishing speed has left scientists scratching their heads. Given the immense duration of its journey, one might expect Voyager's speed to dwindle significantly over time. However, it seems to defy this expectation, continuing its voyage through the cosmos with unwavering momentum. 
It's a remarkable feat that challenges our understanding of space exploration. Neil deGrasse Tyson also believes that upon closer examination, Voyager 1 appears to defy the norm once again, revealing its exceptional nature with its latest discovery. It was a regular day for scientists until Voyager 1 delivered a bombshell of news, leaving an indelible mark on their memories. The spacecraft had stumbled upon a collection of enigmatic objects drifting through space. This discovery took everyone by surprise, as it was entirely unplanned. Astronomers were initially baffled when they sifted through the data and found evidence of approximately 500 unknown objects materializing seemingly out of nowhere. One moment, these objects were entirely unknown to us, and the next, they appeared on our radar, sparking a frenzy of curiosity and speculation among researchers. In the blink of an eye, scientists found themselves grappling with a perplexing puzzle that nature had unexpectedly dropped into their laps. The blame for this problem fell squarely on one culprit, Voyager 1. Ironically, scientists realized that the key to unlocking this mystery also lay with this very spacecraft. Interestingly, as news of the discovery spread, many were left in disbelief and doubt. Powering through the cosmos. When news of the discovery first broke, some scientists pondered the possibility that it might be a mistake. They speculated that perhaps Voyager 1, after nearly five decades of service, was showing signs of its age. Could it be that its systems were faltering, leading to wrong data transmissions? Considering Voyager 1's long and dedicated service since its launch in 1977, such a scenario seemed plausible. Over almost half a century, one could imagine the spacecraft's onboard computers growing weary, struggling to carry out their tasks efficiently. It was conceivable that they might start to malfunction, producing flawed data that confounded the ground team. While the story may seem tempting, scientists caution against delving too deeply into this realm, as it would undermine the remarkable perseverance of Voyager. Despite the relentless challenges and ever-changing conditions of space, Voyager 1 has remained steadfast in its mission, continuously providing invaluable insights into our universe. Contrary to the doubts of doubters, Voyager 1 has defied expectations and maintained its longevity, largely due to its clever design. Equipped with redundant computer systems, just like its twin, Voyager 2, it boasts two sets of command subsystems, flight data systems, FDS and Altitude and Articulation Control Systems, ACCS. These redundant systems ensure that Voyager 1 can withstand the rigors of space travel and continue to function effectively, even in the face of adversity. Moreover, this hidden strength has been the driving force behind the spacecraft's unwavering determination to navigate space and uncover its secrets. The redundancy built into its systems has played a crucial role, allowing for smooth transitions between components and the ability to activate backup parts when needed, thus prolonging their lifespan. When engineers crafted Voyager 1, they devised a meticulous plan to ensure the probe operated at maximum efficiency. This meant that its instruments had to rely on robust, hardwired logic. With time constraints and limited power resources, they couldn't afford to take any risks in this area. Electrical engineers made the strategic decision to develop the instruments using simplified systems based on hardwired logic. As a result, Voyager's computer systems consisted of six onboard computers arranged as a distributed system, ensuring reliability and functionality even in the harsh conditions of space. After conquering the challenge of creating three sets of dual redundant pairs, scientists encountered another formidable obstacle sustaining these systems. It was like facing a towering brick wall, daunting and imposing. However, they didn't back down. Instead, they devised an ongoing power management strategy to overcome this daunting hurdle. Power management involved ensuring that Voyager's computer systems could continue to function effectively despite the limited power resources available on board. This task was akin to sending a hunter into the deep jungle 
armed only with a set of knives. A daunting prospect indeed. Yet scientists found innovative ways to navigate this challenge. They implemented various measures to conserve and optimize power usage aboard Voyager. One such measure involved selectively shutting down non-essential systems, akin to a hunter conserving energy by focusing only on essential tasks. This approach allowed Voyager to make the most of its limited power resources, ensuring its continued operation in the vast expanse of space. But unfortunately, engineers faced a tough choice and had to adopt a systematic approach to address it. They carefully identified and deactivated components or subsystems that weren't vital for the spacecraft's main mission objectives. One clear example of this strategy is seen in the heaters connected to certain instruments, which had to be turned off. Originally, these heaters were meant to maintain the instruments at specific temperatures for optimal performance. However, to reduce power consumption aboard Voyager, engineers had to rewrite this narrative by deactivating the heaters. But a great move was made at extending the Voyager's lifespan. NASA's power play to propel Voyager's quest. Now, the reduction in power usage not only benefits the spacecraft's immediate needs, but also has a ripple effect. And that's the fact that it greatly helps to extend the Voyager's lifespans. It's a win-win situation for everyone involved. It's important to note that the decision to power down non-essential systems isn't made lightly. It's a carefully planned activity that involves weighing the pros and cons of power conservation. Whenever such decisions were made, it required a collaborative effort from all team members. Engineers and scientists came together to assess how deactivating specific systems would affect the quality and availability of scientific data. Emotions didn't factor into these discussions. It was purely a business decision based on factual analysis. The team's primary goal was to maximize power efficiency while ensuring the spacecraft's essential functions remained intact, allowing it to continue gathering vital information about our universe without interruption. Both engineers and scientists shared a common desire to ensure nothing hindered Voyager's journey as it delved into the hidden secrets of space. These are secrets that the universe has guarded closely for centuries. However, selective power reduction isn't the sole method NASA engineers are employing to keep Voyager operational and performing optimally in space. They had another trick up their sleeves, one they had to reveal for the spacecraft's benefit. Alongside scientists, engineers devised power management strategies tailored to the ever-shifting conditions of Voyager's environment. For example, as Voyager 1 ventures farther from the Sun, the amount of solar energy available dwindles. This could pose a significant problem, but the engineers were ready. They anticipated this challenge and made sure the spacecraft adjusted its power consumption accordingly. This flexible approach showcases the ingenuity of NASA's engineers and scientists, demonstrating their ability to adapt and overcome obstacles in the vast expanse of space. Efficient power allocation is crucial as it ensures that the available resources are used wisely to support the probe's vital operations and the transmission of data back to Earth. But the good news doesn't stop there. Continuous technical advancements and upgrades in power management have allowed engineers to refine and optimize the spacecraft's power systems over time. A closer look at these improvements reveals enhancements in power distribution better methods for charging batteries, and advancements in power regulation and regulator. Implementing carefully planned power management strategies has opened up new possibilities for engineers. It has enabled them to extend the operational lifespan of Voyager 1, as well as its twin, Voyager 2. This achievement is a significant victory for the scientific community and humanity as a whole. By meticulously managing and allocating power resources, Voyager 1 is now equipped with the strength needed to continue its exploration of deep space boldly and without the fear of faltering. But when scientists at the ISS least expected it, Voyager 1 sent in what's probably its most shocking transmission ever. Defying expectations and exploring infinity. The spacecraft has embarked on a fascinating scientific journey 
defying its age as its critical systems remain operational. This allows it to continuously send valuable data and provide enlightening insights to the ground team on Earth for as long as possible. Considering that the spacecraft was initially expected to last only five years, this enduring performance is a remarkable achievement worth celebrating. The credit for Voyager 1's exceptional performance belongs entirely to the dedicated efforts of scientists and engineers. Their unwavering focus and tireless dedication ensure that the spacecraft operates at its best. They invest significant time in researching and evaluating the conditions of space to maintain the spacecraft's optimal functionality. Their relentless pursuit of excellence ensures that Voyager 1 continues to thrive amidst the vastness of space. Despite the commendable efforts of scientists and engineers, space remains an enigmatic and unpredictable realm, where even the most meticulous preparations can be rendered futile by unforeseen circumstances. This sentiment was vividly illustrated by the recent discovery of 500 previously unknown celestial objects, casting a shadow of uncertainty over our understanding of the cosmos. Deep space, with its vast expanses and myriad phenomena, holds secrets that continue to elude even the most seasoned astronomers. While our knowledge of the universe has grown exponentially over the years, there are still countless mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Voyager 1, one of humanity's most remarkable achievements in space exploration, found itself at the forefront of this mystery when it detected the presence of these enigmatic objects. The spacecraft, which had journeyed farther from Earth than any other human-made object, suddenly became the harbinger of unsettling news. Neil deGrasse Tyson also believes that as scientists and engineers received the unsettling report from Voyager 1, a sense of urgency pervaded the scientific community. The prospect of unknown objects hurtling through space with potential intentions, perhaps even hostile ones, sparked a flurry of activity as experts sought to decipher the implications of this unexpected revelation. So in the face of this unprecedented challenge, the scientific community rallied, leveraging their collective expertise and ingenuity to formulate a response. Debates raged, hypotheses were proposed, and contingency plans were hastily drafted as researchers handled the baffling question of how to confront this cosmic mystery. Despite the uncertainty and apprehension that gripped the scientific community, there was also a palpable sense of excitement and determination. For scientists, encountering the unknown is not just a source of fear, but also an opportunity for discovery and advancement. Neil deGrasse also states that, in the days and weeks that followed, telescopes around the world were trained on the heavens, scouring the depths of space for any clues that might shed light on the nature of these mysterious objects. We have a telescope sitting a million miles from Earth. Yeah. Parked, observing star birth in front of our eyes in our galaxy and galaxy birth at the, early, the uni early universe in high resolution. We sent a space probe to collide with a moonlit of an asteroid. <laughs> Meanwhile, engineers worked tirelessly to ensure the safety of Voyager 1 and its vital mission, devising strategies to mitigate any potential risks posed by the unknown intruders. As the scientific community grappled with the cosmic enigma, the incident served as a proof of the inherent challenges and uncertainties of space exploration. Yet, it also underscored the resilience and resourcefulness of humanity in the face of the unknown, reaffirming our enduring quest to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. This discovery was completely unexpected. Typically, the Voyager spacecraft was designed to encounter meteoroids, asteroids, and other celestial debris as it traversed through space, allowing us to study these objects. So you can imagine the surprise when the Voyager stumbled upon strange, unidentified objects that didn't fit into any known category of space phenomena we've documented over the years. It was as if these mysterious objects appeared out of nowhere. Adding to the confusion was the concern that these objects might pose a threat to Earth. However, in the ensuing weeks, scientists determined that this was not the case, putting those worries to rest. 
Interestingly, Voyager 1 captured something way more shocking just as it reached interstellar space. Now, it is one of the most significant achievements by mankind, and it happened without anyone even knowing. NASA says that Voyager 1 has become the first man-made object to reach interstellar space, the cold, dark region between stars, far from the influence of our sun. It actually happened last year, but NASA only confirmed the data on Thursday. Earlier, I spoke to Ed Stone, a scientist on the Voyager 1 project, and I began by asking him how he felt about this milestone. We had hoped when we began this mission in 1972 that uh, we would reach interstellar space, but none of us knew, knew how big the bubble the sun creates around itself is or how if a spacecraft could last so long as to actually leave the bubble and enter the space between the stars. A puzzling anomaly in outer space. A new challenge quickly emerged as soon as Voyager 1 reached the fringes of interstellar space and it began transmitting rather unusual data. Researchers needed to understand why the Voyager had transmitted such confounding data in the first place. As soon as the unsettling data was detected, scientists were faced with the daunting task of unraveling the mystery behind the Voyager's unexpected findings. In the scientific community, the term anomaly echoed through the halls of research institutions and space agencies alike, marking the unprecedented nature of the situation. The Voyager probe, a stalwart explorer of the cosmos, had veered off its expected course of transmitting routine data about the interstellar medium and cosmic phenomena. As the news spread, capturing the attention of both seasoned astrophysicists and curious enthusiasts, the specifics of the anomaly stirred a mix of fascination and concern. The signals received from Voyager 1 were not just irregular, they were bafflingly cryptic, akin to receiving an unexpected message in an unknown language from a distant corner of the universe. Despite the complexity of the data, scientists marveled at the resilience of the Voyager craft. Despite the enigmatic signals it transmitted, the spacecraft remained obedient to commands from Earth, a testament to the robustness of its design and the ingenuity of its creators. What puzzled scientists even more was the seemingly contradictory nature of the anomaly. On one hand, Voyager 1 continued to dutifully communicate with Earth, its antenna steadfastly aimed towards its home planet. On the other hand, the telemetry data it sent back defied explanation, leading to a collective scratching of heads among researchers worldwide. In the days and weeks that followed, dedicated teams of scientists and engineers embarked on a rigorous investigation, combing through every piece of available data and scrutinizing every aspect of Voyager's systems. They delved into the spacecraft's onboard computers, analyzing its software and hardware for any signs of malfunction or interference. As the investigation progressed, one thing became clear. This was no ordinary glitch. It was a conundrum wrapped in mystery, challenging the very boundaries of our understanding of space exploration. With each passing day, the anomaly continued to captivate the scientific community, sparking countless theories and hypotheses about its origins and implications for our understanding of the cosmos. Yet, amid the uncertainty and intrigue, there was also a sense of excitement, a feeling that we were on the brink of a groundbreaking discovery that could reshape our understanding of the universe and our place within it. For the scientists and engineers tasked with unraveling the mystery of Voyager 1's anomaly, it was both a daunting challenge and an exhilarating journey into the unknown. In the labyrinth of perplexity, scientists and engineers embarked on a relentless quest to decipher the enigma surrounding Voyager 1's anomaly. They delved into the spacecraft's intricate systems, scrutinizing every line of code and every electronic pathway for clues to unravel the mystery. As they dug deeper, they uncovered a myriad of intricate subsystems meticulously crafted to safeguard the spacecraft's journey through the cosmos. Among these was the intricate fault protection system, a complex network of sensors and algorithms designed to detect anomalies and swiftly guide Voyager into a safe mode, shielding it from potential harm. However, during the anomaly, 
this safeguard remained eerily silent, confounding the experts who had meticulously engineered it. It was akin to a vigilant guardian inexplicably turning a blind eye to danger, leaving the spacecraft to navigate the unknown unaided. Despite their expertise and years of experience, scientists found themselves facing an unprecedented challenge. The anomaly defied conventional explanations, stretching the limits of their understanding of space exploration and pushing the boundaries of scientific inquiry. Yet, amidst the uncertainty, there was an undercurrent of excitement, a sense of embarking on a voyage of discovery into uncharted realms of knowledge. Each new piece of data brought with it the promise of unlocking the secrets of the universe, propelling humanity one step closer to the stars. For the researchers immersed in this cosmic conundrum, it was a testament to the boundless curiosity and ingenuity that drives the human spirit to explore the unknown, no matter how daunting the journey may seem. And as they continued to unravel the mysteries of Voyager 1's anomaly, they remained steadfast in their pursuit of truth, knowing that the answers they sought lay waiting to be discovered amidst the vast expanse of the cosmos. As researchers persisted in their quest for answers, their collective efforts gradually chipped away at the layers of uncertainty surrounding this perplexing discovery. Each day brought new insights and revelations, propelling them closer to unraveling the intricate web of mysteries woven around Voyager 1's anomaly. Besides, an amazing connection was later revealed by the researchers between the anomaly and ACCS. The surprising connection to ACCS. Amidst the flurry of data analysis and simulations, researchers unearthed a surprising connection between the anomaly and the altitude and articulation control subsystems ACCS. These critical components essential for the spacecraft's navigation and orientation in the vast expanse of space, held the key to understanding the anomaly's origin. What astounded scientists even more was the revelation that the malfunctioning computer linked to the ACCS had somehow managed to bypass the spacecraft's intricate fault detection mechanisms. It was a testament to the complexity of Voyager's design and the unforeseen challenges that lurked within the depths of space exploration. As researchers delved deeper into the anomaly's origins, they uncovered a series of events that bordered on the realm of cosmic coincidence. It appeared that a combination of factors, including cosmic radiation and the harsh conditions of space, had conspired to trigger this unprecedented chain of events. Moreover, the discovery shed light on the resilience of Voyager 1, which had continued to operate despite the malfunctioning component. It was a testament to the spacecraft's durability and the ingenuity of its creators, who had equipped it with redundancies and fail-safes to withstand the rigors of space travel. In the annals of space exploration, Voyager 1's anomaly would stand as a testament to the inherent unpredictability of the cosmos and the boundless determination of humanity to unravel its mysteries. And as researchers continued to probe the depths of space, they knew that each discovery brought them one step closer to unlocking the secrets of the universe. As a result, the data being sent back to Earth became corrupted due to the malfunctioning onboard computer. This unexpected obstacle disrupted the smooth flow of data transmission from Voyager to Earth. However, scientists were still left pondering the underlying cause of this troubling event. Why did the anomaly suddenly emerge without warning? Despite finding some relief in recent discoveries, their minds remained unsettled, haunted by the possibility of Voyager encountering 500 mysterious objects in space. In an effort to dispel this lingering uncertainty and regain peace of mind, scientists devised a clever solution. They instructed the ACCS to reroute telemetry data to functioning systems effectively bypassing the problematic computer. This solution was chosen for its low risk, and it proved to be successful in resolving the issue. Yet, even as they celebrated this triumph, a new challenge emerged. The communication delay between Voyager and Earth was significantly prolonged during the investigation. While this outcome initially sparked concern, 
scientists ultimately dismissed it as a minor issue not worth losing sleep over. After all, they reasoned, the vast distance separating Voyager from Earth naturally introduced delays in communication. The vastness of space presents a staggering challenge for communication between Voyager and Earth. At a distance of 14.5 billion miles, the time it takes for radio signals to traverse this immense gap is considerable, often leading to significant delays in communication. Bridge to the Star To bridge this astronomical divide, NASA's Deep Space Network DSN comes into play. Consisting of a network of colossal radio antennas strategically positioned across the globe, the DSN serves as the lifeline connecting Earth to spacecraft, exploring the distant corners of our solar system and beyond. Each antenna in the DSN is a marvel of engineering, capable of capturing and transmitting signals across vast distances with pinpoint accuracy. These antennas work in unison, ensuring continuous communication with spacecraft like Voyager, even as they journey millions of miles away from our home planet. But the DSN's role extends beyond mere communication. In addition to facilitating vital two-way communication, the network also conducts radar and radio astronomy observations. These observations provide invaluable insights into celestial phenomena, expanding our understanding of the universe and unlocking its many mysteries. Through the tireless efforts of the DSN and its dedicated team of engineers and scientists, humanity continues to push the boundaries of exploration, reaching ever deeper into the cosmos in search of answers and discovery. When data is transmitted from Voyager to Earth via the Deep Space Network, it often utilizes a specific communication channel known as Channel 18. This channel operates within the radio frequency range of 2.3 GHz GHz, allowing for efficient data transfer over vast interstellar distances. Conversely, when signals are sent from Earth to Voyager 1, a slightly lower frequency of 2.1 GHz is utilized. Despite the minute difference in frequency, both transmissions travel at the speed of light which is approximately 299,792 kilometers per second, about 186,282 miles per second. However, the breathtaking speed of light doesn't completely mitigate the challenges posed by the immense distance separating Voyager and Earth. Even at this remarkable velocity, it still takes approximately 22 hours for signals to traverse the vast expanse of space and reach the spacecraft. So this means that after issuing a command for mission control, the team must exercise patience as they await any confirmation or response from Voyager. The 22-hour delay underscores the profound distance between the probe and our planet, emphasizing the monumental task of maintaining communication with distant spacecraft, exploring the cosmos. The reason why the mission team handling Voyager is so careful with their commands is because of the significant time delay in communication between the spacecraft and Earth. Any mistakes in the commands they send could lead to longer waiting times for responses, so they take their time, spending hours reviewing and double-checking commands and plans before sending them off. This meticulous approach helps prevent issues and unnecessary delays. These time delays also impact the diagnosis of anomalies like the one recently discovered by Voyager 1. While it's commonly believed that the faulty telemetry data sent to Earth may have been caused by the ACCS receiving a bad command from an onboard computer, researchers aren't entirely satisfied with this explanation. They feel like there's still something missing from the puzzle. Neil deGrasse Tyson feels some researchers are considering other possibilities, such as cosmic radiation or extreme temperatures, as potential causes of the anomaly. So, despite the prevailing hypothesis, the scientific community remains open to exploring all avenues to unravel the mystery surrounding Voyager's unexpected findings. In the vast and unpredictable expanse of space, even the smallest micrometeoroid can wreak havoc on spacecraft like Voyager 1, which has braved the cosmic frontier for over four decades. Despite Voyager 1's robust construction, 
Its outer hull bears the scars of countless encounters with these celestial particles, each impact a testament to the unforgiving nature of the Void. Moreover, as Voyager 1 continues its odyssey through the cosmos, its once state-of-the-art systems are gradually succumbing to the relentless march of time. Components wear out, radiation degrades sensitive electronics, and the void of space, with its extreme temperatures and vacuum, takes its toll on the aging spacecraft. In conclusion, Voyager 1 persists as a symbol of human ingenuity and exploration, transmitting invaluable data back to Earth from the far reaches of our solar system and beyond. Scientists scrutinize every morsel of information received, poring over telemetry and spectroscopic readings in search of clues to the mysteries of the universe. What are your thoughts on these enigmatic discoveries made in the cosmos? Please share your opinions in the comments section. And if you enjoyed watching these videos, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel.